Welcome folks, my name is Peter and welcome to Jackass. Nah, that's not the intro. Welcome folks, my name is Peter and I am the Jackass. That's better but not quite right. Welcome folks, my name is Peter and today I will show you how to lose money on flip cars. Well, that's the better intro, that's the right one. So let's get into it. Every other car flipper there is on the YouTube will show you how to make money on car flips? Well, I'm not a car flipper, so not me. So let's take the first step to losing money on cars. Step 1. Buy a set of wheels for a car that you don't have. But they were only 75 bucks, so hey, why not? Step 2. Buy a car that will not drive itself off. Step 3. Bring your tools. Step 4. Replace the broken parts and try to drive it home. This one had this nice blue out on this hose. So let's try to get it home. Voila, I've got it home. So what do you think? Did I make it home? Or would we have to tow it? Take your guess down in the comment section right now. Well, the guy I bought it from drove it with that broken hose home. I don't know how far he drove it, but um, I knew that it will be a little bit of a problem. Um, anyway, I got there, I was planning to film on there, but uh, I just uh, didn't want to irritate them even more. And uh, so I didn't film the process of retrieving the car and uh, the journey home. But uh, long story short, I filled it with uh, the water. With the straight water and I drove it home. For 25 kilometers everything was fine. Then I heard a little bit of timing chain rattle. So I decided to pull off on a parking lot. Once I was slowing down and I depressed the clutch, the car died, I jump started through gear and it ran fine. I got out of it, there was no water in it, it was boiling over, uh, even the oil leaking from the valve covers were, bo were boiling. So um, I didn't have the better idea than to put water, the straight water in it. And uh, yeah, we blew a head gasket or cracked the head and I will show you why in a minute. Because um, it probably had some head gasket issue before I pour that cold water in but now it definitely has one. I wanted to show you how badly it's smoking but um, I'm not able to anymore. Let me show you why. Well, well, but before I got into that engine, I forgot to show you what I even bought. Well, the car I bought is a 2004 Ford Fiesta with 1.3 liter in underneath the hood. And as you can see, it's pretty low. And well, it's not lowered. It's got broken coil spring. I don't know if we will be able to even put you through. Probably not. Uh, but the coil spring on this side is broken. Uh, it's, it's scratched. The rear bumper is uh, repaint, but badly one. <coughs> Inspection is not current. The LPG tank is not current, uh, tires are shot, brakes are shot, the engine is gone, interior is dirty, filthy, it has 268,000 kilometers, so I bought it for 450 bucks, and this car is worth 1500, so I know I will lose money already. Step 5, let's pull the head of this thing. Step 6, change your mind and pull the whole engine. Here you can see the amount of water that went into the catalytic converter. Step 7, change your mind and buy a new engine because the 
face hardened camshaft is worn. Step 8. Break the brand new engine that you bought from the junkyard because the guy on the, in the junkyard left the pipe and broke it off. And I tried, but yeah, well, I destroyed that engine. Step 9. Let's open up this engine and see if we can use at least the head. Well guys, this is off the record. Uh, I might do a separate video on this. Um, well, I broke the valve cover loose. And let's see, look at look at this this engine probably never had an oil change. Can you see the amount of junk in there? Can you see the coal? The dinosaurs in this almost started to form up back again. Well, guys, this is this is nuts. <laughs> I made it. I may do this a separate video because, well, this is, this is wow. I have no words for this. Well, and finally step 10, get the old head from our engine and send them to the machine shop. You can see pistons where the water intrusion was. Um, there is a bit of rust on the sleeves and also the pistons are much cleaner than the other ones and uh, there is the water damage, the bent valves when I hydrolocked this, en this, this engine so uh, this head is trash and we need to use that other one so this is it for today's video, I hope you liked it uh, this is the 10 steps how not to make money flipping cars. Well, if you want to do that, well, this video is really for you. So if you want to see more of this uh, Fiesta uh, project, uh, well, you can subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for all the likes, shares, comments and all the new subscribers. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.